Hello, and welcome to another video tutorial by Technocation. In this tutorial, I'll show you a great little Chrome tip that has you messing with Chrome flags. I learned about this tip on my way to work this morning from a podcast called Google Educast, sponsored by EdReach. I highly recommend that you check out this podcast um, if you love Google like I do. Great podcast, lots of tips and tricks that they share. Uh, it's a great resource for, uh, for Google lovers like me. Um, anyways, this tip involves the little avatars that you can assign to each of your Chrome users, uh, your, Chrome, your Chrome user accounts. You can pick from a very limited assortment of pictures, but for this tip, I'm gonna show you how you can change that avatar to match your Google profile image. You'll first need to access the Chrome Flags page. Now to do that, you'll need to open up a new tab, which I already have set up here. And in the Omni box or the search box, you want to type in chrome colon forward slash forward slash and then the word flags with an S. Press return and it'll take you to this page where um, the flags exist and flags are experimental um, or experiments um, within chrome and you can enable and, and disable any of them. Now it does come with a warning message that these experimental features may change and they may also break and they may also disappear at any time. So you have to be aware of that. And you have to be careful when you're messing around with flags. Uh, but for this tip, you'll want, to, uh, you'll want to conduct a page find search. Now to do that, you go to the, the, to the edit menu, choose find, and then find again. And a little uh, uh, search box will slide down. In the search box, you'll want to search for G-A-I-A. And it should automatically take you to a specific flag called Enable GAIA Profile Name and Icon. Okay. Now, um, to get this to work, you'll need to enable this particular flag. And to do that, you click on the blue, f um, the blue Enable link. Okay. Once you click Enable, you'll get the option at the bottom to relaunch now. This will, uh, this will quit out of Chrome, and then it'll relaunch it um, in order to activate that flag. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. It'll take a couple seconds to relaunch Chrome. Okay. Uh, once Chrome has relaunched, you may notice that your user account avatar um, will automatically change to match your Google profile picture. If it does not automatically change, you'll just need to access your settings. Okay. And under Users, you'll want to edit that user. And you should see your Google profile image for that specific account. Now you can select that image or that picture as your avatar and click OK. And it'll become your avatar where you can switch between users. And as you can see, I have uh, using two separate Google accounts here, each with its own uh, Google profile image. Well, thanks again for watching this video tutorial by Technocation. Feel free to check out my blog for more EdTech tips uh, tricks, opinions, and reviews. And until next time, thanks for watching.